What's up, hungry people? It's Rex with Eat Magazine and Eat OC Now. I'm with Brad. We're at Gems. Everyone calls him B-Rad. <laughs> that right? That's right. <laughs> well, after this. Where did Jim come from? Originated in Fount Valley, 1971. It's the second store. So your father created Jim Meats originally? Right. I grew up at a meat market. What happened uh, growing up in a meat market? Yeah, you learn how to cut meat. The first store I took over in 19, 1981. Oh, okay, so at 19 years old, you took over. You were on the border of Fullerton and Placentia and your Belinda, really. I mean, you're right, right. here in the middle of the, the three cities. You've been here for... 74. Eight, 74, okay. So you're probably one of the oldest. Is butcher shop, a, is that a PC term these days or is that okay? I don't know. Is, it, is meat cutting is what we call it? It's a butcher shop. It's a butcher old shop. Old fashioned. Okay, old fashioned butcher shop. There's a few of us left. How many left? Not, Not too many. many. Not many. You have meat, produce, fish, deli items, a little bit of everything. What's the difference between prime, select, and what else is there? Choice, prime, select. Just basically comes down to the marbling and the beef, how they feed it. Okay. The better fed it is, the more expensive it is. So is there an actual difference between prime, select, and choice? Yeah. Okay. The price. We carry certified Angus to make it good, flavorful and tender. During the holidays or events, is there any kind of like special cut that you recommend or? Well, we do a lot of prime ribs at Christmas. Okay. Uh, that's our main thing. Prime ribs? We offer fresh, natural grown, free range turkeys at Thanksgiving. Okay. And offer any special cuts over the holidays from ground pork roast to lamb legs, boar's head hams. A little okay. bit of everything. If we don't have it, we'll get it. So, Jim, you have, a, you have a group of guys that have been here for 25. 25 years. 25 years cutting meat together. There's five of us. Do people rely on these individuals for cooking instructions, you know, okay. certain cuts, recommendations. Do you do um, special marinades and this kind of thing? We sell a whole slew of marinated products beef kebabs, chicken kebabs, marinated chicken breasts, kebabs, ribs. Okay. We do a little cooking too. Oh, just cooking here. Okay, what do you cook? We cook turkeys, prime ribs, basically anything people want. So somebody can order a cooked turkey and then come in and pick it up? Sure. Okay, and or order a cooked prime rib? Yeah. Okay, how do you cook that? Uh, over an open flame or is it? No, nah, rotisserie oven. Not boiled or something? Nah. Like that. It's actually, no, it's okay. It's actually yeah. Rotisserie you know. oven. And how long does it take to cook that? It depends how big a piece of meat, whole prime rib. Uh, it's probably two, two and a half hours. What's big. the biggest piece you've ever cooked in your rotisserie? Probably a 20 pound prime rib. How big is a 20 pound prime rib? About that big, right? Okay, big. about the size of a baby. Yeah, pretty good size. You like cooking for people? It's more of a convenience item for people. We don't do a whole lot of it. Just okay. certain customers order okay. year in and year out. What about the people that are watching this? Will you, will you do it for them? Sure. Oh, okay. I'm the workhorse. Yeah, okay, all right. I'm so, the cutter. What's your favorite thing to cut? I cut the meat case every day. You get a very large meat case. 56 feet of meat counter. That's a lot of meat counter. Uh, what's your favorite thing to cut? I like to cut steaks. Do you like eating steaks? I love them. Do you get the best pieces and you don't let us have them? Sometimes. If I'm having a barbecue, I'll hand pick them. I'll bet you get the best meat for barbecue, huh? Of course. People love to barbecue with Brad. Yeah. Be rad. So where did the name Jim come from? I think my dad just wanted to keep it short and we were kind of right next to Jim Co. <laughs> so, uh, wow, that's like the worst name story I've ever heard in my life. Okay. So they were next to Jemco, right. and his dad, in, in, in absence of any kind of name, just looked around and said, hey, they call that place Jemco, I think we'll just call our place Jem. Yeah, it worked. It worked, <laughs> all right. So there you go, that's, the, that's how Jem came about, from Jemco, which is no longer in existence, but. No. No. That's it, Gem Fine Meats and Produce on the border of Fullerton, Placentia and Yorba Linda. Come check it out. Check out Be Rad. They'll be right there behind the counter cutting meat in the largest meat counter in North Orange County. I don't know. I'm just making that up. Let's eat some meat. Do it.